hi guys here in this video i am going to show you how to fix slmgr rearm not executing issue if you are facing issues with slmgr rearm command so if you are getting the error the maximum allowed number of rearms has been executed so here is the video this will help you to fix this issue here go to registry edit in the registry edit section click on hk local machine now click on double click on software now search for microsoft and in microsoft now search for windows nt folder here is the w section and windows nt Windows NT is here. Double click on Windows NT current version. Double click on current version and search for the folder Software Protection Platform. Here is the Software Pro Protection Platform. Now click on the registry skip PR and change its value from 0 to 1. 0 to 1 click ok and now close the registry edit restart your system and your slmgr rearm not executing issue is fixed now and if you are getting error slmgr is not recognized as an internal or external command so here i am going to show you first make sure that command prompt is open with administrative rights because if it is not open with administrative rights it is the command is not going to recognize by the system so make sure your command prompt is opened with administrative rights okay and um, the second thing is that make sure that the command slmgr rearm is properly written I am showing you here the command is slmgr dash rearm so this command has been written properly if it is not written properly it is not going to execute and if both the things are okay and still the command is not recognizing by the system then I am showing you here one more thing go to my PC local disk C windows then system 32 and in system32 folder find slmgr.vbs file I am looking for slmgr.vbs it is a scripting file slmgr.vbs here here is the slmgr.vbs file and if in your system it is not slmgr it is written something else like slmgr.vbs.remove white so change the name from slmgr.vbs.remove white or something like that to slmgr and save it here in the same folder and close now close the window and now again restart your system now the problem of not uh, recognizing your the command is fixed now so thank you for watching the video